So uh, still goalless here, of course, but it's the victory on the front foot as um, Galloway does well to uh, keep that in there. Yeah, and again, it was Valeri that uh, knocked the ball wide. He's just, we can see him again, Valeri, getting on the ball, looking for things to happen, orchestrating things. Yeah, it's the first time I've seen him tonight, I'll be honest, and he's, he does look a class act. He's um, a thinkler as well, I've been uh, impressed with him. He's, he's a tidy little player as well and looks to, well, he's involved in this move here into uh, Brescia. The shot comes in and it's in the back of the net and the victory have got the lead. Well, we've been saying it has been coming for some time. They've been pushing virtually since uh, uh, the first whistle. And again, another nice um, passing movement. Costas Barusas, Barbarusas there with a fantastic finish. But what about the play around the edge of the box? Compared to how they played in the first half, it has been a little bit disappointing, not zipping the ball around as, as much, not creating um, any opportunities. I don't think Spence in the, in the Bayswater goal has actually had anything to do in this uh, second half. He's not had a save to make, has he? Could change now if uh, Brisha can uh, get a shot away, cuts it back, and it's a 2 0, just as we say that. And uh, the victory have wrapped uh, the game up now. A bit of a commentator's curse there, unfortunately, for Bayswater. It but, was. Um, it was. But again, a fantastic run by Bessup Barisha. And that's what he's good at. You know, put everything aside. That's what he gets paid to do. Make runs up front. Some of them are unselfish. And that was certainly an unselfish run. He tees Archie up brilliantly. And again, Archie's coming off the wide there. We said it, he's got into the box late, a very, very cool finish. And it's what Archie's made a name from all his career, putting the ball in the back of the net. 